Here's a technique to send live drone footage to Instagram. Do a search for instafeed.me and log in with your password and username. Type in the broadcast title and then tap the create new broadcast button. This generates a stream key which you need with a URL to combine for an RTMP address. The URL and stream key combined is placed into the RTMP input of your live stream. I recommend installing Skype in both devices to transfer RTMP addresses. When you live stream from your DJI GO app, the video feed will go to the left side of your Insta feed dashboard, as you can see here. From there on in, you leave the dashboard running. The view on your smart controller is different from the view output of your Instagram live stream. I recommend using the grid system located from your drone's camera settings. As you can see, the portrait lock on the Instagram output feed limits your drone's field of view. Thankfully, this doesn't affect the recorded media or your drone's camera view. I suggest you use the grid system, especially the central grid of your camera view to frame up the live stream output. In conclusion, instafeed.me is a great portable tool for you to live stream from your drone. The downside is you're using double the data to stream to two devices. Also, after five free live streams, you're required to buy more 10 streams for 10 euros. In the end, I find that using this method of live streaming is quite a hassle. And using double the data to live stream to two devices and buying extra live stream credits is too much for any casual flyer. This is the Live Drone Broadcast Channel reviewing the instafeed.me website. Please like and subscribe for some more hints and tips. I'll see you again. Cheers.